Well, Valerie, they're talking a lot about all of the anger over retirement uh, from uh, many different sectors of uh, French society. But uh, it isn't just retirement that is a hot button issue for many people striking today. A case in point is the medical field here in France. Doctors and other medical staff also joining the strikes, including uh, my guest today, Julien Tayeb, who's a doctor. Hello. And, and head of the Digestive Cancer Treatment Center at a hospital in Paris. You also were just at the strike. Uh, what here in France, where healthcare is seen as such a model for so many other countries in the world, what are doctors and medical staff angry about here? Yeah, it's the first time that doctors, nurses, and everybody working in the hospital is uh, participating to the same movement. Uh, because currently, for the first time, we are facing major issues like nurses going out of the hospital, the public hospital, and moving to the private practice because of the salaries that are now too low. We are the 26th level of salary in France uh, of OCDE, uh, as we are also the fourth country, the richest in OCDE. So there is a real uh, imbalance between the, 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 the pensions of the nurses and the, and, the, and the salaries are, and our level in OCD. So I think this may make that in several months the public hospital will go pro possibly very bad and we are just ringing uh, the alarm that there is something now to do and to stop the economies on, and the savings on, on the hospital. And the French government, though, has said that it will inject uh, some one and a half billion euros into the system. Is that not enough? No, it's not enough because it's not one and a half billion this year. It's one and a half billion for three years. And when you count it, really, it's only 300 million this year with 100 being protected for the elderly. So it's only 200,000 million. And as you know, 2020 will be a bisextil uh, year. And just for that, we will need 300 millions more. So we don't have even what was expected from this year with one day more. For many doctors uh, taking the Hippocratic Oath, it's, it's a big deal striking. I mean, some people might even argue that it could put lives at risk. How much did you think about that before striking? Yeah, so, so we, we have clearly uh, stated in our movement, which is a collective uh, inter uh, that we will not stop uh, uh, taking care of our patients. So we have currently in my unit, for example, we, there are six doctors there to take care of the patient today. And I will go back this afternoon. And we did a um, um, demonstration this this morning from 12 to 1.30, so it's a limited period of time. Even with the transportation problem we are facing, it's not easy to go back to our hospitals. What has the morale been like in hospitals? We, we've talked a lot here on France 24 about an increase in suicide amongst uh, medical staff. Yeah, I, th I think there is a, a real uh, psychological problem for, for caregivers because currently we are facing some restriction uh, uh, for, for savings for, for the government uh, decisions. And we have the patient that are needing more and more cares. Uh, the price of medication, as you know, and other the staff in the hospital are increasing every year, uh, so it becomes more and more difficult to treat our patient the best. And uh, so, as you said, we have the hypocrite uh, story, and we want to 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 be faithful to to what we swear. And and clearly today it's more and more difficult to do it. So we need more money in the hospital, and there is money in France. Where, what specifically do you want the government to give you? So we want clearly that the lowest salary are increases substantially with maybe 300 euro uh, for really the lowest one. We are not asking for money for big professors like me or I don't know. We are asking for the nurses, for the, the, the social assistant, for the kinesiotherapist, etc. Uh, the lowest salary have to be increased. Some primes have to be also decided for the expensive cities like Paris, Lyon, Marseille, where the living is much more expensive than somewhere else in France. Uh, we we are also asking for a global uh, increase in the budget of health and to stop closing bed when in some hospital where we already know that many patients are waiting for beds for days. Julian, thank you so much for coming to speak to us. As Julian Tayeb, their doctor and head of the digestive cancer treatment at a hospital in Paris. Thank you very much.